Good Wednesday afternoon. Meteorologist Kaylee Bowers here looking outside. We're finally seeing some sunshine and enjoy that because we're tracking more rain chances on the way for the second half of the week. But this Wednesday afternoon, nice and dry with actually some clear blue skies and all four of our views on our Lake Lake Erie camera. It's just so nice. So things are quiet here in at least Ohio, but looking off towards the Northern Plains, we're watching that counterclockwise rotation, which is indicating an area of low pressure. So bring some more widespread showers to the Dakotas all the way down into parts of Nebraska and even into Kansas. So that's a system we're watching that will be bringing us rain for Thursday and Friday. As far as watches and warnings go, we're still seeing some high wind watches in South Dakota, but looking off towards California, they are still dealing with extreme heat. The folks there dealing with that heat advisory. We're nowhere close to being under a heat advisory, but we're seeing temperatures at least in the mid 50s at this lunchtime hour here in Toledo, but looking a little bit closer to your neighborhood. We're seeing around 56 in Fremont. Same thing in Tiffin Sandusky around 56 and same thing in Port Clinton. That seems to be a popular number at this lunchtime hour, but satellite and radar not showing any rain, really not showing any clouds, but we'll see a few more clouds increase as we go on throughout the rest of the afternoon and this evening. Forecasting highs for today still technically below average by about two, even one degree. Just depends on where you are, but seeing temperatures in the low 60s. Looking ahead towards the rest of the day, 64. So our forecast at high, it's going to be brighter and also milder. Still seeing temperatures in the 60s for Thursday. Showers return because of that area of low pressure right now in the Northern Plains. More rain Friday and also into Saturday. But along with that low pressure system, we're watching a cold front that will cause our, temp cause our temperatures to dip down to the upper 50s on Friday to the mid 50s on Saturday. And I'll show you your extended forecast here in just a moment. We're forecasting highs for Sunday in the low to mid 50s. So things really will be cooling down. There's those clouds increasing throughout this evening as we get ready for that low pressure system to move, to move in later on tonight and into Thursday morning. Now we won't see rain until right around commute time late morning, just depending on where you are stopping this just before lunchtime 11 AM. It's moving into our western counties by the afternoon, heading home from school, heading home from work. Still some more on and off rain is possible, but really watching that moderate, even pockets of heavy rain throughout the evening and throughout those nighttime hours. And more rain is expected for Friday and also into Saturday. So today is dry and Sunday is also dry. We're just watching the end of the week and the first half of the week, and you will certainly need that rain gear just like Puddle Ducky. Our temperatures, though, at least today, not too bad. Fairly seasonal in the low to mid 60s, still in the 60s for tomorrow. But then the weekend, there we go. Sunday is our coolest day at 52 degrees. A cool start to next week, 54. But then we climb back up not only to the low 60s on Tuesday, upper 60s above average. Finally, for Wednesday and by Thursday, still in the mid 60s and wrapping up next week will be in the low 60s. And as of now, for the end of the month, we're still tracking above average temperatures for October 25th to Halloween. But remember, our average highs by then are in the upper 50s and the low 60s. So anything warmer than 60 degrees will be considered warmer and technically above average. As far as you can see, the radar, not too bad. But you can always get this sent straight to your devices. Just search the WTLL weather in the app store. It's free to download and has a lot of amazing things from interactive radar to your hour by hour forecast to your extended forecast. And this is what we're showing you right now. Forecast, at least not for today, not too bad. 64 with that mixture of sunshine and clouds. Here comes the rain Thursday, Friday and Saturday and those cooler temperatures. 56 for Saturday, 52 by Sunday. Clouds continue to stick around for the second half of the weekend. Drying out next Wednesday, not looking too bad. Feeling a lot more like spring rather than the middle of fall. 68 with plenty of sunshine, but more rain expected by the end of next week. Have a great rest of your day.